A new month and the eternal question, what should I read? So I've been going through the lists of new releases and considering books that I've already read. I think I've come up with a pretty good PBR for this month. Uh, to start, I'm going to finish the Quantum Gravity series. Read the first, reread the first two books last month, and we'll read the last three books this month. Not much to say about that. It's a futuristic sci fi fantasy. Also, I think I'll reread Solo Leveling, which is a novella series that currently has seven books in it, translated to English, that is. It's, it's written by a Korean author. And the books are being translated reasonably quickly. So I plan on rereading those seven books this month. They're only 200 pages each, so shouldn't be too much of a challenge. And I really enjoy the premise. For those that don't know, it's kind of a play on One Punch Man. But the journey to becoming that kind of overpowered character... It's it's been converted to a, a manhwa, and I think there might be an anime series coming out for it as well. I'm not sure, but the original, the, the source material, are the short novels that I plan to reread this month. I'm getting into new things. Uh, the Final Architecture series by uh, Adrian Tchaikovsky. Let's hope I pronounced that right. Um, the third book came out on the second. It uh, looks like it's a sci-fi series, so I'll pick up the first book and see what it's like. And if I like it, I'm sure to pick up the other two and probably read them this month, too. Um, other than that, let's see. There's a bit of an odd one. Not normally. There's a couple odd ones on my list this month. Not normally to my taste. The first is a uh, Ching Yang All Stars by, ooh, that's a name, Nana Kwame Ajebrenya. I have zero confidence in my pronunciation of that, but it's a dystopian sci-fi book about people in prison. I think. Like I said, not normally my thing, but it looked interesting. We'll see if I manage to to finish it. Uh, not heard of that author before so we'll see how it goes and moving on to a third hard to pronounce name uh the threads that bind by kika hats hats polo hats polo it's a greek mythology fantasy set in atlanta georgia it looks like another thing that uh, another subgenre that isn't generally what i read but I like Greek mythology, so we'll see what this author did with it. Uh, that is coming out on May 30th, and I'm going to be rather conflicted between that one and The Witch King by Martha Wells, which is also coming out on the 30th, and appears to be more your standard kind of fantasy, but the, the premise and the blurb certainly caught my attention. I'll get to one of those two books this month, and the other one early next month, I'm sure. But that pretty much wraps up everything I, I plan on reading this month. There might come other books that I feel like reading or rereading that I pick up, but let's see, that's 3, 10, 13, 16 books. So we'll see if I get to them all. Um, I'd like to read at least half of them, but we'll see how it goes. As always, if you like the video, like, if not, dislike. And if you've seen any books that you think I should be reading or giving my attention to, uh, please let me know in the comment section. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day.